Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Shunbu 2 with God of Dare and Don't One Up Man. In the last episode we conquered the Ghost Hall building. And we finally found Wanda Zoo in the process. But as soon as we found Zoo, we were approached by Don Yu. He'd found Zoo too. Ren was with us, but Ren didn't help much. We got into an altercation onto a fight with Don Yu and his men. We needed help by Su Ying. But they managed to capture Zoo and bring him to the Yellow Head building. So now we're going to find out how to get into that building and rescue Zoo before Don Yu gives him the Lan Di. Um, I hear the voice of a certain young man. Yes, you do. I want to go to the Yellow Head building. The Yellow Head building is the building in the middle of Kowloon. Go inside and walk straight. All right. Thank you very much. The old man is a good source of information every time. You can't go wrong with him. He knows a lot about Kowloon. We gotta figure out how to do this, how to get into this building. Cause we gotta get Zoo. We were so close, we were right there. We survived planks of wood from so high up in the in the air to if we fall we die. <laughs> and I died a lot, as you can see in my last video. This is the yellow head right here. You don't belong here. Get lost. What? Won't I have to look in. for a different way in. Well, we're not getting in that way. Guards blocked the main entries into the Yellowhead building. Find other way in. Well, let's try this way. Cafe Anna over there. This looks like an entrance here. More guards. Can't allow anyone through. Just get out of here. Not here. I'll try a different entrance. No dice. Find yet another way in. Don 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 don. Um, Shenmue 3. <laughs> I'm supposed to be getting my copy tomorrow. Well, today, maybe even. Cannot wait. Uh, I'm not letting any outsiders in here. Go home. Are you still hanging around here? Ren. I think there were other entrances. Well, they were all closed off, Ren. We couldn't get in. They're all totally blocked off? Yeah. Danny in here isn't gonna get us anywhere. Think of some other way. I thought you weren't interested anymore. <laughs> I changed my mind. What? I think it will be profitable after all. You will make Do up your you mind. Like. Hey, let's go. Where are we going? Always check out the tea shops for information. Cha Wan sign? Yeah, we'll split up. I'll check around the stand quarter. You check out some other quarter. Okay. Cha Wan sign. Whoa. Just so happens there's some tea shops right here. Let's try it. Hmm. Looks like I can make the sign there. Let's do it. Okay, I'll start. So yeah, I'm very excited and I figured out how I'm going to uh, go about recording that. 
Because make no mistake, I can't have the game and not play it, people. I've been waiting for this game. <laughs> this game's third installment for 18 years. As soon as I get that game, I'm playing that game. <laughs> as simple as that. I got a PS4 right for it. I should look for another. Got a PS4 for the game and winded up loving the PS4 for a multitude of other reasons. Alright, so the shot one side was unsuccessful here. Let's try the next place. Right next door. Hmm. Looks like I can make the sign here. Okay, I'll start. I've had very little time to record these videos. Oh, something's happening. Been so busy with other things. Hmm. This is from Zang. Moonchild Building, Room 503. I'll look for the Moonchild Building first. Moonchild. We were there before, but I forget where it was. Let's ask this waitress, or... Excuse me. Welcome. This lady. I need to get to the Moonchild Building. It's ahead from here. If you ask around in the stand quarter, you'll find it immediately. Thank you. I don't think that'll be necessary. It's over there, dim sum building. I don't need to go there. But yeah, uh, if it was up to me, I would have been done recording for Shenmue 2. Dancing Dragon! But, uh, it's not so easy with my position, my situation right now. But we'll get there. We will definitely get there. Shenmue is not a game meant to be rushed. Here's the Moonchild. The Moonchild building, room 503. Alright, so let's get up to that fifth floor. See what's there. Boom, boom, boom. Let's take an elevator. Good thing we don't gotta worry about that switching of elevators here. Here we go again. Alright, 503, right? Boom, 503, 501, 502, 508. That's not it. 503. What awaits us behind this door? E3! That's a game show. Come in. Well, whoever's here knows I was coming. If you are afraid, now is the time to go back. Ryo's not afraid of anything, as far as it pertains to revenge. May I ask you to spar with me? In this darkness? Darkness offers me the perfect environment to see your skills. This guy looks familiar. Here I come. What kind of a man would be able to fight in the dark?
Can't hit him. Can't see him. Get off me. You fiend. Mother. Face him, real. Come on. Hey up. And hey up. Can't hit him. Do not rely on sight. A disturbed mind can make you impatient. Are you not aware of the voodoo? Remember what Su Ying taught you, Ryo. Done. Yes. Do not rely on your eyes when in darkness. Dismiss all other thoughts and see with your mind's eye. My mind's eye. Do the John Claw Van Damme blood support. It's time to put up your dukes, Rio. Concentrate on your hands. are slow you're fast but I'll get you relax fast old man Mind's eye. Clear your mind. Keep hitting to the diagonal instead of side. Gotcha. Have a natural aptitude. Sense the opponent without relying on your eyesight. This is called predictive explosion. Predictive explosion. Sounds like the coolest name in the game. Coolest fighting move name, but uh, <laughs> very basic. Just teaching you to fight with your eyes closed without using your eyesight using oh, your other senses you were playing the Chinese fiddle what you can see I feel lied to I feel betrayed you are Iwao's son you know you all you knew my father about 20 years ago your father visited this place my father came here. Miu Ao had much interest in the Chinese martial arts. We became friends and often exchanged our knowledge on moves. Is Iwao well? Sure, I wish I could say so. Uh, he was killed by a man named Lan Di of the Chiyo Men. He wouldn't be here otherwise. Killed? By Lan Di? How terrible! Iwao was killed. Murdered. In cold blood. With the birds' morning echoes. Clouds gather 
as you pass away, shedding tears. If there is anything I can do for your father. Well, now that you mention it. Do you know who Young Da Zhu is? Does he have anything to do with the death of your father? Yes. I heard that Zhu is being held captive at the Yellowhead building. The headquarters of the Yellowhead. Indeed. Is there a way for me to get in there? away well then you must tell me old man who is this man he's a scout for the yellowhead a scout he finds talented practitioners of martial arts to send to the chio men if he picks you, you may be able to get inside the Yellowhead. What should I do? If you can keep winning at street fights, there's a chance. Street fights. Well, Ryo, it's time to stay, change your name to Ryu. Are we about to become a street fighter? Get in touch with a scout to get inside Yellowhead building. Thank you, old man playing fiddle. Never got your name, but... Boom, boom. So, there are a plethora of places to fight here in Kowloon. You just have to choose what you want to do, where you want to fight. Each fight's going to be different. The rules, that is. So, I tend to go for the three easiest forms of fighting here. You could ask around. People will tell you where they are. Excuse me. Let's ask yeah. this gentleman. Do you know a place where I can participate in a street fight? There are four places in the Stand Quarter. One of them is an arena in the Black Heaven building. I understand. Thank you. Well, but, not gonna go there. We're gonna go to scar Stargazing first. We got Cool Z here. What's up, buddy? Hey. Uh, what? Don't you need to be keeping watch at the hideout? Shut up. I'm taking a break here. Radio's taking By the way, his whole don't face you out. Want to hear something good? Huh? That guy is quite tough. You can't win if you just attack from the front. Really? Yeah, and what would you suggest? You have to go around to the guy's blind spot. The blind spot? Yeah, probably for just a second. He's going to lose the sight of you. All right, thanks. Oh, cool Z dropping knowledge, huh? Let's try our luck here. Well, let's test our skill, rather. We don't need That's luck. Him. Yep, that is him. That's the scout. So we got to do well here. here is not just any expert when training in the mountains he killed a tiger with his bare hands I doubt that he lost his eye in that battle but that's proof of his bravery one match for a bit of ten dollars well, that doesn't seem too 60 bad seconds. 60 Anyone seconds want to challenge this man oh we'll challenge never back down from a challenge here I'll do it. All right, here's a young man. He's young, but looks like he can fight. Yeah, I would say I could. Take your stance. Ready? Go! 
All right, so here we're gonna follow what Cool Z said. Try to stay on his right side. That eye, maybe the left side is his blind spot. Oh, they're gonna give you a first person view. Want to be careful not to fall out the ring. If I can get to his left. He's only level one difficulty right now. Because this is a fight that you can bet money to win, as you saw. So each time you fight, it'll get harder. He was in my blind spot. Amazing! Here you go! Yeah, you make some money in the process. Not a bad gig. That's one down. One-eyed fighter in the stargazing point. And the game will uh, document, Rio will document where he fought. There was another one, but I don't quite remember exactly where. It's the specific one I'm looking for. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. I think it's this here. Small dragon. These are my three favorite ones to do, as they're not too difficult. Yeah, this is a. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is. Now imagine playing this back in 2001. Let's talk to this guy. Excuse me. Don't block my view. Don't talk to me. Oh, damn. Wouldn't want you to miss the action, prick. That's him. Ma Unwan here. He is one of the best warriors of martial arts. His Chinese martial arts technique is passive raid style. He'll gracefully parry the opponent's attack. Strike him even once and be the winner. Okay. The time limit is 30 seconds. 30 seconds to hit. Bet of $10. Anyone strong enough to challenge this man? I'll do it. I'll do it. Good. His eyes have strength. I've been through a lot of battles. Take your stance. You'll soon figure this out. Three, go. Nothing. No! Gotcha! Good match! Here you go! I've been defeated. You have much kung fu. Well, when you've been on the path of revenge for as long as I have, you understand. You learn a couple of things on the way from masters of many, many styles. That's what I like about this. It's uh reminds me of Bruce Lee uh incorporating many different files fighting styles. Alright, so that's two down. We got one more to go. The last one is, in my opinion, the easiest one. I was gonna tackle that first, but since this is on the way, I figured that hey, why not just get it out the way now. Thousand whites. There's Joy's motorcycle. She at Cafe Anna? Yeah. Let's talk to her. Joy. What? Do you know a street fight arena close by? You aren't going to participate in the street fights, are you? Hell yeah. The I only am. way to get inside the Yellowhead building is to win at street fighting. I don't have time now. I'll explain later. You are so rash. 
I am. Um... Oh well, there's one right past the Thousand White Quarter. Anywhere else? Another one would be at... Go out to the plaza and take a right. It's in the alley between the Thousand White Building and the Ghost Hall Building. Oh, all right. Well, that's the one I was going to go to. Well, I didn't know then. I know now. But yeah, right here. We passed it a couple of times. The rules are simple. That's him. Now, in Zhang Zhou, here is one of the best masters of acrobat style, martial arts. Swift as a flying swallow, leaping as high as a monkey. Catch this man here and be the winner. One match for a bet of ten dollars. The time limit? Thirty seconds. Anyone confident enough to try? Where's the challenger? This is actually a very easy way to earn money I'll if you do don't it. have any prior. Here. Can you keep up with my speed? Because this fight doesn't get much harder ever. Take your you just have to grab this guy one time. Ready? Go! I caught you. Yeah, you see how easy it is. We got a winner. Just by mashing the grab button, you, you can do it early on. Damn, he read my moves. Very easy. Amazing! Here you go. Yeah, so we've done it all. We've got $30 to our credit. Come to Dragon Street at sundown. Dragon Street. Well, lucky thing for us, it is about sundown. There. Let's go to Dragon Street now. Where's the scout at? Hey. Here's the shady bastard. You are. There are too many people here. This way. Better not try to murder me, man. My kung fu is strong. defeat these three people in these photos, huh? Well, we gotta find out where they are now. Must defeat these street fighters. Now, people, is when the fighting in the game is really picking up, as you notice. Let's see if this man knows anything. Um... He's been Do helpful thus far. Something from me? Why you keep pretending to be blind for money? Um. Well, in in fairness, he never asked us for any money. Let's ask where Rod is. Do you know this man? This man, I have seen him in the Phoenix Building. The Phoenix Building? The fighting place at the very back of the Tea Break Building. The back of the Tea Break Building is the Phoenix Building. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, sir. Rod Stunt in the Phoenix Building. The reason I'm going to Rod first is because you need to pay an entry fee for all these fights. And he is the cheapest to fight. And as you win these fights, you will gain a good amount of money. Enough to get to the next fight. So as long as you're able to get into the first fight with Rod... You'll be able to get in the next ones easily. That's why we're doing him. The T break building is this away. Wasn't it? 
It's been a little while since I've been over here. Joy. That's Joy. What? <laughs> it is an awkward way to talk to her. Let's talk. Let's face her when we talk to her. Excuse me. Did no, you not know? him. Not her. Hey. Do you know this man? He competes in the street fights in the Phoenix building. Really? No mistake about it. Why don't you go? You can get there from the tea break building. Oh, it's yeah. In the back of this place. <laughs> oh, all right. I've done one of Rio's. I've asked where something is right next to it. I've been picking up too much off you, Rio. To be birds building. Hold on, hold on. Here we go. See where this get shady customer is? This is where you want to go. This is who you gotta give the money I to. I want to ask you something. What the hell do you want? As you can see, he's a pleasant fellow. Um. Do you know this man? Yeah, he's right in here. Really? Aren't you challenging him? <laughs> You're a little champ, aren't you? Oh, I'll surprise you. Um. You need five hundred dollars to enter here. It's a lot of money. But we'll pay it. Yeah, I'll pay. Good luck. Hope you don't wind up on a slab. Yeah, it'll be him who's on the slab, I promise that. Here you can play Afterburner. Let's ask this guy where Rod um, is. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a place where I can join in a street fight. The fighting arena is on the fourth floor basement. The fourth floor basement? Thank you very much. How can I get to the fourth floor basement? Go outside and you'll see a staircase on the right. Outside, there are stairs on the right. Awesome. Uh... Well, there is an elevator here, so we need to go to the fourth floor and then go to B1 from there. More puzzling exploration. Not too difficult to understand though. Elevator is going to be right here. I want to say, like, a lot of action's coming up next in this game. Which I always enjoy. Whenever the action picks up in Shenmue, it's always a joy. With a red motorcycle. See what we can see from up here, right? Well, we can see the arena. We see no one fighting yet. I can hear the punches, though. No punches being pulled there. B4. Here we go. Let's see what's up. Let us see what is up. Got some cool music. Mmm, sit down power bomb. There's a wrestler, huh? Reminds me of King from Tekken. The backbreaker. Looks like a powerful guy. Gonna have to be careful with this one, Rio. That's him. One thing I will complain about in these fights is you can be ringed out. Good. And the the rings could you be kind of small. Yeah. Hey. 
Come on, boy! Come on! If I lose this fight, odds are it's gonna be because of a ring out. I'm calling it now. The fight itself isn't all too difficult. It's actually quite fun. Ready? Go! You can also ring out the opponent. But I don't want to do that. Whoa. Oh, we ringed him out. Ready? Round two. Go! Nice. Hit you with the iron palm strike. Oh. Mm. Oh. Mm. Probably better to take the move there as I probably would have been ringed out. But we win the fight just like that. The awesome. Wins. Very enjoyable. Love it. Uh, side note. After you've done these street fights, you can play them over in the main menu of the game. Whenever you want. Oh, I got kind of careless. <sighs> Looks like it. Yeah. I'm gonna get you for this. Next time, you're gonna lose. I don't know about all that, buddy. I think I beat you pretty uh, fair and square there. And we got $500 for, uh, for our troubles. Was it 500? I think it was more than that. Got a good sum of money. Well, it's time to go and get out of here. Back to the fourth floor we go. Next, we're going to be going after Greg, and he's definitely a wrestler type, too. But Greg's a, a different beast. You'll see why. We're on the fourth floor now. Let's get back down to the f first floor. Let's talk to this guy, see what he has to say now. Remember, he didn't think much of us before. I want to ask you something. I'm shocked, man. Huh? I can't believe you beat Stunt. <laughs> Thanks to you, I lost so much money. I bet I'll lose my customers from now on, too. That's Damn your it, problem. My business is ruined. Should have bet it for me. Well, tough luck for him. Everyone's restaurant. Dun, 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 dun. We're all supposed to go through everyone's restaurant to get out of here. Well, 
was it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. All right. Well, Joy, you gave us good information there. Let's ask you about Greg. See hey. what you can tell us. Do you know this man? He's at the Blue Dragon Garden. The Blue Dragon Garden? Yeah, no mistake. Where is it? Go straight ahead to the Stand Quarter. When you get to the Big Fountain, turn right. The Blue Dragon Garden is ahead. Oh, all right. All right. Thank you, Joy. Let's go find Greg and fight him. Got to do this to impress the scout so we can get into the yellow head. And his fighting arena is going to be next to where we were before, but more so to the right. I want to ask you something. You want something? Yeah, I need to get in. Um... Do you know this man? Yeah, he fights right here. Really? He has never lost a bout. Undefeated, huh? Interesting. Well, I need to get in there. Um, it costs a thousand dollars to get in. Oh yeah, it's a lot of money, buddy. But I'm gonna pay it. Yeah, I'll pay. You got guts, kid. Good luck. Thank you, sir. how awesome this looks especially at night very cool let's get this fight underway this is what I meant do you see the size of that fighting ground the fighting floor is the smallest of the fighters and Greg likes to ring out his opponents with a specific move he will show off in this fight. Look how dope that camera angle is. Love it. Very nice. The giant swing. I don't trust anybody with a butterfly vest. Alright, this I could definitely get ringed out in. Hope not, but let's see what happens. <laughs> this guy ready to fight. Ren! A man who can really fight, huh? Well, look no further, you know. Friend, what are you doing here? Huh? Ah, uh, it's you. <laughs> now, does anyone want a challenge? Any strong guy want to break Greg's record of consecutive victories? I do. Come on now, anyone out there? Uh, over here. You want a challenge? Forget it. You're no match for me. <laughs> That's my line. Okay, Who Guijong. Who dare lose against Wimp as slow as you? Uh -huh. Giving it a shot? Yeah. Good. It's settled then. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, well, th Ren. Thank you for just volunteering me like that, Ren. This is my bet. Don't make some money off me, huh? That Ren. What a Come guy. On, kid. Well, well, needed to do I'll it anyway, no Rio. Mercy. There you go. That's the spirit. Oh, 
Machine gun! Trying to get away from the fucking edge. <laughs> the fool tripped. I'll take that victory. That's two down now. Here you go. Thank you. Our wow, look at that money go next. up. Hmm. Damn. What's wrong, Ren? Ren. You should be a rich man right now. Because of you. What? Uh, I won. <laughs> You're such an idiot. I lost because you won. Oh no, Red. Red. You that fool. Means... Shut up. Just shut up. That Red. Well, next time, bet on me. You fool. It's late now. I'd better get some rest. And with that, I also need to end the video. So, I will catch you guys next time in Shenmue 2. And we'll take on the last fighter, Chunyan. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Take care.